we all know the picture in picture mode. You know, you're on your phone, you're watching some content of any types of sorts, and you can also browse the internet at the same time. Well, today I'm going to show you how to do that on Windows. Now, to start off, you need to go to the first link in the description, and you will see this weird web page. Just click piptool.msi. Now, mind you, this was released on March 18th, 2019, so if it just doesn't work out of nowhere, well, it's because it's old. Anyways, click on the .msi file that downloads, click Next, click Next, click Next. It'll pop up with a little menu where you need to press yes. Then once you press yes, it should say click close to exit. Now I have that black screen because I couldn't do this on my virtual machine. So how do we use this picture in picture mode thing? All you need to do is open up an application or anything that has a video in it. I like watching this video, but the guy sounds really depressed. And next up, you just need to click on the start menu and you need to click on picture in picture tool. If you don't have it on your recently added in the start menu, just search up PIP dash tool and it'll pop up here click on it and it'll show this little bar here now you can click the drop down menu and select the application that you want or you can just click on the tab that you want to focus on so i want to look at this video i'm going to click on my browser and you may or may not need to resize this box to the exact video size but once you do that click on the checkbox and this part is very important you need to minimize the tab do not move around the tab because if you do you'll notice it gets ruined but just make sure you have it maximized then minimize it now you have picture in picture mode but here we go another thing you got to worry about you got to make sure you play the video before you kind of minimize it because you can't control it through the little window so i'm going to open up chrome again click on the play button and once you do that now you could open up any application and you could you know figure out what you want to do with your life and that wraps up the installation portion of the video if it worked like and subscribe and if you want to support the channel even further just turn off your ad blocker when you watch my videos and if for some odd reason it didn't work out for you feel free to leave a comment in the comment section or join my discord and put your issue in the help channel and i will help you out as soon as i can now let's get on to the uninstall portion of the video. So let's say the application is a little too buggy for you and you know it's kind of confusing. How do I move all this stuff around? Well, all you need to do to uninstall it is first off, make sure the application is closed. So click quit, then open up the start menu, type in add or remove programs and press enter. Then it'll pop up with this applicate. Then it'll pop up with this window here. You just need to search for PIP and you will see the PIP tool. Click on it and click uninstall and click uninstall. You will need to press yes on a window that pops up. Once again, I'm not on my VM, so it doesn't show that. But once you press yes for admin privileges, it will uninstall. And now you don't have to worry about it anymore. And that's it. Now picture in picture tool is gone. You don't have to worry about it. Now you can focus on things that make you happy, like being a Fortnite pro gamer or, you know, something else. Anyways, I'm going to go play with a nail gun and see how far the nails can travel before they penetrate my skin. Anyways, have a fantastic night, sweetheart. I love you. Mwah.